extra years. There we go. Thank you, guys. And with that, sports betting is officially on the table in New Hampshire. It will be regulated through the brand new division of sports betting under the New Hampshire Lottery Commission. 15 licenses will be released, 10 for retail locations, and 5 for online. Well, those folks have to go get local approval first before they can negotiate with us. As for who will receive those licenses, that will go through an application and approval process. But the state is hoping to score big with this move, projecting a large revenue windfall. And the budget's contained um, $10 million uh, year two, so $10 million is our profit projection, and I think we can hit that comfortably. It goes right back to the schools. Um, you know, this year we crossed over $100 million for the first time out of New Hampshire Lottery going right back into, into the schools. I mean, that's, that's real money. It was going on before, and it wasn't legal. Now the government's going to get a little piece of the action. It's going to be good all around. If people want to do it, it's up to them. Um, I think it's good for the economy, and you know, I think New Hampshire will do well with it. But with the new law comes concerns over problem gambling. The bill does have some provisions in it where it requires the online gamers specifically, and even some of the um, the retailers, to watch for problem gaming, where you have uh, betting that's occurring that is indicative of problem gaming, and it can hold people out from saying you can't bet anymore. And another provision in this bill, betting on local college sports teams is off the table, so that cannot happen. The first legal bets are expected to take place sometime next year. Live in the newsroom, I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.